finding phi. Now, phi is a irrational number that goes on forever and ever. And it, um, it's known also as the golden ratio, okay? So phi itself, now if I can draw it, here's the lowercase and uppercase letter of phi, okay? Phi itself, now bear with my phi drawing, is equal to one plus the square root of five over two, which is approximately 1.618. And it keeps on going forever. Right? It's irrational. What we're going to do today is talk about how we can calculate phi, a way to calculate phi, to get phi using continued fractions. Okay? So we know a continued fraction for phi, okay, is 1 plus 1 over 1 plus 1 over 1 plus 1 over 1 plus forever and ever, that continued fraction, okay? So What's hard is that we can calculate this. You can put this in your calculator, do it by hand, and keep going each iteration all the way, and you would get that 1.618. But there's something we can notice here, okay, that if we see this part right here in the continued fraction, that part is phi itself. We can see it's 1 plus 1 over 1 plus 1 over, which is this part, right? 1 plus 1 over. In this little blue section, we have phi itself. So I can rewrite this continued fraction really as just phi is equal to 1 plus 1 over phi. And now we could solve for phi. Now to solve for phi, all right, we have to get phi by itself. All right, so to get phi by itself, you have, well, we can subtract a 1 to both sides, right? And we have phi minus 1 equals 1 over phi. And then we can multiply both sides by phi, right? And I'll bear with my, me as, as I go, my phi's get uglier and uglier, okay? And we distribute this, we have, well, that's phi squared minus phi, right? Equals 1. And then again, we can subtract 1 to both sides. And we're left with, well, phi squared, oh man, it's getting bad, minus phi minus 1 equals 0. Now, right here, something should be clicking your head. We have a quadratic. Well, we know the quadratic formula. All right. If you don't know, there's a video I have that you, uh, teaches the quadratic formula, how to memorize it. But it's negative b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a. And here we have an a value on our quadratic. a value is 1 b value is a negative 1, and c is a negative 1. Now be careful when plugging into this quadratic formula because there are a lot of 1s and negative 1s and minus signs. You're going to make sure that you have everything in line. So as we go, now what, what I always recommend is substituting, when you substitute anything in, you put parentheses around it. So we have a negative, all right, and then b is a negative 1 plus or minus the square root negative 1 squared minus 4. a is positive 1 and c is negative one, okay? Be careful with all these little ones and negatives one. Double check that, okay, with parentheses. Now, negative times a negative is a positive, so we have a positive one here, plus or minus, oh, sorry, all over two times one, almost forgot that. So you have a one plus or minus, all right, one plus or minus the square root of one squared, which is one, minus four times one times negative one is a negative four, so we have Okay, so we have 1 minus a negative 4 over 2. And then you minus the negative 4, that is a positive, right, plus a positive. Two wrongs make a right in mathematics. So we have 1 plus or minus the square root of 1 minus a negative 4, which is 1 plus 4, which is 5 over 2. Now, we're almost there to what we said in the beginning, that is 1 plus the square root of 2 over 5. I'm oh, sorry, 1 plus square root of 5 over 2. But we have a minus, 1 plus or minus. And we notice back into our original formula that this will always be a positive answer. There's no way this can be negative. A positive plus a positive plus a positive. This, we're always only adding positive numbers. We can only have a positive answer. So therefore, our phi, our value for phi, is just 1 plus the square root of 5 over 2, which we've talked about in the beginning. Okay, so here is how you can get fee from that continued fraction, a way to get fee. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel um, if you enjoy our videos, as well as you can follow us on Instagram, Facebook, um, and links are down below in the description. 
Thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.